Okay, we're back now, and as promised, uh, we're going to do a simulation of a real robot. This is a uh, robot from the FRC uh, 2014 game uh, from Team 190 called uh, Pack Goat. And, uh, and so let's go ahead and get that one going. So this time we're going to do a C++ example. You can do the same thing in Java. We're going to choose the pack code example. And we're going to call it pack go. And then, and then we're going to make sure that the it's in the pack code world and we're not doing gears bot. So what's the difference between the pack bot world and the gears bot world? So the pack go world is an actual FFC 2014 field with the game objects and the pack go robot. And the gears bot world has the soda cans in the box. Okay. So I'm going to finish and we have a project. So the one of the differences with C++ is that you have to make sure you go to C++ the C++ perspective in Eclipse and then you'll see this hammer and you need to tell the hammer that you want to build for simulation and then it will come up and it will build everything which may take a while depending on the size of your project this project is rather large because it's based off of Team 190's actual code. And it's, it's really the same code, it's just been cleaned up, simplified, so that it can work with one joystick instead of four joysticks that require training to use. And some of the more advanced features aren't quite as uh, accessible. But the main core is still there. Yeah, I think this also may be running a little bit slower because we're running it in a, in a virtual machine on a Mac instead of running it in Linux. So the performance is a little bit uh, less than, than had we been running it uh, on a native uh, Linux system. Still building, compiling the program. So you can see it's compiling all the modules. Yeah. And, and we may just uh, cut this here and then, and then go back to the finished version of it. Anyways. All right, so it's finished building now. So now we're going to launch it. And we're going to launch it just like you do for a uh, Java one, where you just do a WPI simulate option. And it launches everything. We get Gazebo. We get the driver station. And there we are. And so this is a pretty nice uh, rendition of the field that we can play in. So, uh, um, we'll, so we'll, we'll kind of demo this robot operating now. Launch it. So we have one as WPI simulate. And it's launching everything, so here's Gazebo, and in a second we'll get the driver station, and we're going to run the autonomous. So here you can see it's a full FSC 2014 field with four balls of the pack of robot and everything else on the field. So it's going to drive forward and shoot the ball and score. So now I'm going to switch to teleop and we're going to pick up a ball. So we pick up, or well, we try to pick up a ball. It's hard doing this. Yes, driving is... Uh, there it goes. All right. So now we're going to put it up, and we're going to aim, and we're going to shoot and score. Okay. So. It that, works. Yep. So that's the pack goat robot driving on the 2014 field. Um, so next time we'll show you how to start a program from scratch and to not use one of our examples, but use these two robots that we've shown you. That... Okay. So that's, that's really good. So, so uh, until next time, uh, have fun playing with these two and feel free to modify the code to make it do whatever you want. And, uh, and we'll see you later.